Hello guys, welcome back. So, I've been running my Ender 3 non-stop for the last few days. I am making parts for a, a wheelchair. Let me see if you can see it. I, I'm making a, a wheelchair for my dog. Um, I'm using PVC pipes and some 3D printed parts. And this machine has been running like a workhorse, non-stop. I, I think I previously said in a, an old video that I will never run a 3D farm for my Ender 3. I, it, this, this changed my mind because this thing is, it, it runs non-stop, no problem. It's kind of it's slow and steady, but it gets the job done. And it kind of reminds me of a uh, Toyota. <laughs> uh, Toyotas that, that will run a million miles. I mean, Toyotas are not known for the fanciest, uh, the fastest, I mean, maybe Supras, but the, the fastest car, but they're known for the cars that will last you a lifetime. So this machine has been running nonstop for the last few days. No problem at all no problem at all so yeah going back to the 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 doggy wheelchair yeah so there is not that much information on dog wheelchairs for the size of dog that I have um, he took a tumble last week but he's been limping a little bit for the last month um, and we went to the vet, uh, and sadly he has, well, the, the vet cannot confirm. He only did a visual examination, but the vet said that he might have a, um, one of these, um, neurological disease. Um, he's not sure yet. He just said that he has a lot of the symptoms of a neurological disease. And but yeah, so right now I'm getting him a wheelchair just to get him around, just to get um, uh, yeah, just so it could be easier for him to get around and do his stuff, and play around and do his business. So I've been running this machine to print the parts for that, and man, I'm amazed. I am amazed. I think I think the Ender threes. Um, it's a, a big game changer. I think ever since the, this machine came out, um, a lot of things change after that. A lot of machines nowadays are, are based out of this model, the way that they did this here. Um, so I'm very, very, very happy with this machine. Really, really, really nice and gets the work done. Um, a lot of people say, uh, uh, they would never run a 3D farm. I, I said that myself, I would never run a 3D farm from Ender 3, but this thing has changed my mind. Um, all you have to do is a few upgrades just to run a machine like this constantly w without having any problems. And I think I, I mentioned it previously. To change the, the extruder, Change the extruder to the uh, aluminum metal one, and uh, and that's it. I don't think you need to buy anything else. Um, I printed the the fan uh, from Thingiverse. It's very popular. I think that fan should come stock with the machine. But uh, yeah, I printed the upgraded fan uh, vent and the upgraded um this part here it's the little fan blades the little uh, fan blades are on the fan here the ones that come with the machine um, are very loud and and they rattle um, especially when you're like um 
they get dust inside or dirt they become very very noisy um, but um, man this thing has been a workhorse and I'm gonna finish this chair have it all set up and I'll 